What's up guys, it's Soul, I'm back. Now, as you probably guys could tell, I haven't uploaded a video in quite a while. So this video is gonna be me playing in a master GM and apparently diamond lobby, talking about why I took a break, was there a reason, or did I just go on vacation, and just other stuff about ASOL. So, and uh, as you can tell by the probably the title, am I quitting ASOL? So yeah, this is going to be played in a higher ELO game, but I'm not really going to be gameplay focused on this video. Unfortunately, it's going to be more of a chill and game and kind of talk to you guys type of video. But we will have the OP.GG and the runes on the screen right now. So pretty much the reason why I took a break was because, for one, I went to Mexico with my girlfriend and my family. It was actually really, really fun. But the main reason I took a break is, if you guys are part of my Discord server, you probably saw the messages that I posted a couple weeks ago before I actually... Took that break, I'll put that on the screen right now and give you some time to read it. Basically TLDR if you don't feel like reading. Dude, I don't know how I feel about ESOL. Um, maybe it's the fact that I went on an insanely really bad loss streak. I'll go ahead and have the editor put that on the screen right now. But I don't know, maybe I was just coping a little bit. By the way, we're facing a zillion mid. But yeah, guys, like, I don't know. I really do stand by that message. And I was really sick and tired of trying to kind of be, I guess, fake to you guys. Meaning like, I don't I don't want to pretend anymore that the rework was sunshine and rainbows and that everything was fine and that I completely love the rework because that's just not the case. Unfortunately, I don't want you guys to confuse that from me completely hating the rework because that's not the case at all. Part of the reason of me having like this midlife crisis in terms of the champ and where I want to take this channel is just like the, how the community perceives ASO players and how people perceive the champion. Now it's, I mean, I had a discussion on the Aurelian Soul uh, Discord server and basically TLDR what happened was people were just saying how like basically the community right now who talk about ASO, especially on Reddit, especially on Discord, it's just so negative. Like it's not even a welcoming place for new players to actually enjoy the rework. Like imagine you're a new ASO player trying to find a community, trying to find who plays these champion, talk about him, have fun with them but then you just get a bunch of people who are too i guess fixated on the past now about that like talking about the past and stuff with uh old asol is i don't know my perspective i was in it like you guys know like i made multiple videos about how i wish um there's a play here oh name checks out Anyways, back to the conversation. People are... Guys, I get it. I get it. I miss old ASO too. I really do. I really, really do. Trust me. I miss him too. But here's the thing, guys. Even if we stormed Riot HQ, even if we got everyone to stop playing Aurelian Soul, just even, there's nothing that we can do, guys. Like, I, I see no point in, in just continuously just talking about old ASO and talking about how he was so much better, this or that. ASO is brain dead now. Like, I feel like the only thing that he can do is if you want to be a part of this community still, if you still want to play ASO, I would honestly, I would really just say this. If you don't like ASO now, instead of hating on the champion and making the new rework unenjoyable or per se making the Aurelian Soul community unenjoyable just leave the community it really sucks guys like you guys know that I'm advocates for old ASO I'm gonna watch this Nice little roam there. You guys know I'm advocates for old age soul, but I'm also an advocate for, listen, this is my job. I, I, this is my dream. It's really frustrating when it's my dream to be a content creator and then the rework happens and then like, I'm just confused. You guys read my Discord message. It's just it's just been a hard situation. But basically, what I want you guys to know is that where I stand right now is that I still think Aurelian Soul is fun. He's still my best champion. I do enjoy playing him. I'm going to say most of the time. Obviously, there's times where, of course, I'm a high elo player. He's kind of hard to perform in higher elo, but like you can still do it and still kind of challenging. And I honestly, at this point, stopped caring. I, I mean, I can just put all the hate comments on one of my TikToks that blew up recently was about was like one of the first tiktoks i posted on the rework editor just go ahead and post some of those hate comments here it doesn't have to be all of them but here they are 
just comments like these guys like i'm just so sick of it to the point where my plan kind of is to just keep making aurelian soul content keep trying to push the champion to its limits try to show people that guys i really think i don't know like there's probably gonna be comments in below but you could call it copium really in soul at least playing at the highest level of play higher elos he's quite hard to perform we can talk about things like how yes he's standing still and pressing q but he's also standing still and pressing q which makes him very volatile especially in higher elos where people just know wow Huh. And also, like, his W is just really hard. Like, a lot of his ability, his his kit is simple, yes, but that's also a weakness because people just know exactly how to counter them. It's, it's quite self-explanatory. I'm not really going to go into it because, by the way, a little announcement for you guys. An Aurelian Soul Guide is coming soon. So, with that being said, you're probably asking... Oh, man. Oh man. Oh man, we gotta go. Oh man. Okay, I guess this is a play that's happening. Okay. Okay, <laughs> can I please talk to my audience, Mr. Game? Okay, um, this uh, video is kind of harder. I thought this video would uh, be a little easier to record. Honestly, should have played in lower elo if I was gonna try and talk like this. Oh, at least I got the plate. So with that being said, yes, I am making an official Aurelian Soul guide, which leads me to my next point is if I'm quitting Aurelian Soul. Here's the angle, guys, here's the angle. Aurelian Soul brought me to where I am today. I'm super grateful for the champion. And quite honestly, I, I still think taking that break was really nice. It really opened my eyes kind of and felt really refreshed coming back to the champion. And after two weeks and really think about it, like I still think Aurelian Soul is fun. I really do. And I have to go to this play. I really still think he's a fun character to play. I still think he's one of the most fun characters to play for me, at least. And I'm still one of the best Aurelian Soul players on the server, I do believe. You can tell through my rank. So the angle is I'm still going to make video, be making videos about Aurelian Soul. Now, that does mean, though, that I'm going to be taking a little bit of a different approach. Guys, I've been losing subscribers, believe it or not every single time i upload a video every time i upload a video on tiktok every time i upload a video on youtube and quite honestly the views have been drastically dropping just because i know a lot of people are not fans of the rework which honestly like i don't even blame people i really don't but i'm gonna do what i do and you guys do what you do a lot of maybe some of you guys who clicked on the video are clicking unsubscribe right now which hey man you, you gotta do what you gotta do but I really want to follow my dreams still, and how I want to do that is playing Aurelian Soul. Now, as far as a different approach, the channel is, there's definitely going to be a, a little bit of different things happening. For one, I'm going to be... Uh, to, going back to the hate, I really want to change the League of Legends community perception about Aurelian Soul and how he actually has a lot of depth to him. And I really want to showcase that. And you guys will see what I mean with the guide that I'm working on. The new guide, by the way, is going to be insanely detailed. Um, I already started working on it. And uh, quite honestly, there's a lot more to it than I thought there would be. So I, I'm really excited for you guys to see that. Um, also, I'm going to be a little bit more transparent in terms of videos. I'm not saying, I'm not saying that oh, okay Oh, come on, man. Dude, can I please record this video? Listen, guys, <laughs> I am not saying that Aurelian Soul is the hardest champ in the game. And I'm also not saying that Aurelian Soul right now is harder than last day Soul. Because realistically, that's just not the case. What I'm saying is he actually has a lot more depth than people say there is. And I'm going to show you exactly what I mean by that in upcoming videos. So look out for that. So I really just looking back like... Here's what I want to do. I want to be that guy who really changes how the community perceives Aurelian Soul. 
It's time to go to heaven, my child. Stop it, what are you doing? Stop, stop it, don't stop, stop it, cut it out, don't help. Stop <laughs> I want to show you guys exactly what he can do and how he can be played at a high level. And I want to try and I know there's always going to be hate comments about this champion. Now, I guess, I guess you could say now is... I'm going to be the fucking villain if that's what it takes. I am seen... If I'm seen as the villain for maining this Aurelian soul and being an advocate for Aurelian soul, then it is what it is, then I'm the fucking villain now. Sure, man. It's okay. I just don't care anymore. Honestly, I just don't care, and I don't think anyone else... If you guys enjoy Aurelian soul and you enjoy playing the character, I don't think you should care about what other people think. I think you guys should just slash me at all and play the champion that you enjoy. And if that champion is Aurelian soul, then I'm here for the community. Oh, wow. there. That's worth. Give me, give me. So basically, I will be here for you guys who enjoy the rework. If you guys enjoy the rework, I will be here for you. And if you don't enjoy the rework, then I really want to thank you so much for following my journey on Old Age Soul. And I understand if you're going to leave the community, I totally understand. But yeah, I mean, those are basically my points. So TLDR is that I took a break, was just needed a minute to think about my my next steps for the channel. And I've told you guys my next steps are. Also, as far as content wise, I'm some of you guys might have already noticed that I been kind of uploading content that I mean, I still feel like the content is solid, but it's not exactly content. What is going on? Dude, what is going on, man? Some of you guys have already told me that you guys sometimes see like in the videos that I've made recently that I'm not as passionate about them as you could say. This is another thing that I really want to change. I'm going to start making content that I don't want to just be that one YouTuber who uploads content um, just to upload something like stream highlights or stuff like that. There will be occasional videos like that, but I really want to push the channel to be uploading more content that I enjoy and that I'm actually proud of, like how I did in the beginning of the channel with my live commentary. So you might see more of those and just in general, I want to be more positive for you guys. And I'm just basically, I'm completely, I'm not going to be on the side of revert ASL anymore. If they ended up did reverting ASL, would I be happy? Uh, I probably would be happy, but. Oh man. Dude, what the f I think it's worth though. Yoink! Gimme, gimme. I wanna be on the side of let's try and make the Aurelian Soul community more positive. Like, like I've said, those Reddit posts, the whole community is really, really toxic. And I kinda just wanna create a whole new Aurelian Soul community for people that are actually passionate about playing the champ. With that being said, um, another big announcement is that I really want to, as long alongside making dedicated Aurelian Soul content on this channel, I really want to try and push for a second channel, not a secondary channel. Don't confused though it's a second channel a second main channel uh focus more on content um outside of really soul so like maybe i do a series trying to climb to diamond playing a character that you guys want to see or maybe i just do like troll builds on really soul or not on really soul probably but oh. and it's just perma fight I'm not gonna lie i'm so autopilot in this game I have no clue what is going on. But yeah, I'm gonna be making a secondary channel, content focused um, outside of Ruling Soul. So like troll builds, etc., etc. I mean, we'll see where it goes. I mean, I don't have a channel up and going for that quite yet, but maybe, oh, we're going for this. Maybe by the time this video is up, I will have a channel for that. It will be linked in the description below. If it is up, if it's not, then I'll announce it sometime soon. But I hope you guys are excited for that. I mean, I just kind of just had a... Oh, wow. What the... What the... Kind of a new passion for YouTube and basically how I want to approach content. I'm dead. I should have... I'm trolling. I'm trolling. I knew Alistar was waiting for me. Ugh!
so yeah, I kind of just basically I just want to make content that I enjoy and the content that I'm proud of. That's what you need to know. So I mean that pretty much covers exactly what I wanted to be announced. So just to go over it real quick, I I'm sick of the hate. I'm just gonna basically ignore the haters and try and be the most positive that I can about the rework and make content uh, revolving around uh, the people who actually enjoy the champion. I also want to create a new community for the champion in terms of pretty much just funnel out all the people that or constantly harassing people for playing the rework or all and just in general being negative about what the rework is because again like i said a million times i am an advocate for old asol but i still find this new one good and i see no point in reminiscing about the past so i'm just gonna get over it and make content around the champion that i currently like which is aurelian soul and i also just want to make new content uh, on this channel focus more on being more personal with you guys being more passionate about about my videos and i also am trying to make a new channel about um I'm dead right i also want to make a new channel um doing a more variety of league of legends content and just all around like pushing myself uh to uh, reach more people because I really I really want to do it guys like I don't know I haven't really talked about myself I guess we can get into that a little bit I mean I've got I've said this before but like not really like really talk to you guys about it this is my dream uh, I dropped out of school school wasn't for me I I really don't like school but I also don't want to be a bum I don't want to be jobless and I also want to follow my dreams and content creation is always a thing that I've always wanted to do for a super long time. And this past couple of years, I've been doing content creation for me three years now ish, two years probably. And I found some success, as you guys can see, with the channel and community that we've built. I, I really want to push it. And if you guys could support me and what I do, I mean, it really just means the world to me. It really does. This guy's dead, surely, right? Sure, how to play this? I wonder if I even had to flash. By the way, it's gonna go dragon. But yeah, like you guys' support really just means the world to me, and uh, I I really do appreciate everything that you guys do for me. I really do. Thank you guys so much for everything. With that being said, I guess that's pretty much all the announcements that I have. Again, I really appreciate each and every single one of you, and I guess the rest of the video will just me focusing on this game. I quite honestly don't know what's happening because I've been kind of just giga autopilot, but let's just go ahead and try and dissect and win this game. Oh, also another conclusion thing. A soul guide, like super in depth, like crazy. Like I'm just really excited for you guys to see this guide. I mean, it, it's insane. I, I, I won't really spoil anything for you guys, but the guide will probably come within the next couple weeks. So look out for that. Uh, so yeah, really soul guide coming soon. That being said, let's focus on the game and let's freaking win. How about that? I was facing Twitch.tv Zillionaire. Uh, I don't know. Let's see the win con. Okay, we have three dragons. Let me just catch myself up real quick. Um, they have a Nilly Jungle. Is little fad Yone? I have Hourglass up. No flash. Okay, I'm caught up. Oh my god, my Zig is kind of chovy though. Um, stand still, press Q. Stand still, press Q. Lots of skill, lots of skill. I'm dead. Oh, that was a bad R, but I have big R now. Unlucky. I do have big R for this next fight, though. I see this is really bad, actually. Oh, God. Oh, God. My bad, actually. Run! Uh, we're just permacot. Unlucky. Oh, we actually lost here, I think. But I think if this is the end, uh, I hope you guys enjoyed the video. I mean, it wasn't more of a gameplay. Oh. Of course. Dude, this guy has R up again? Come on! That's actually kind of ridiculous. Oh. Oh. Well, maybe Camille picks up all three. Copium. Okay. 
Okay? Wait, it's actually kind of huge. Big. Um, we, we just win this? Wait, 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 we go, we go. We go, we go, we go. Holy sh- That's actually kind of a banger. Wait, and... Nexus, 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 Nexus. Nexus, Nexus. 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 Nexus! Yeah! I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Thank you guys so much for watching. And let me know what you guys think about my points and just everything going on. Again, I really appreciate the support from you guys. And um, I hope you guys continue to support me. Thanks for watching. Bye.